Hi, I'm Dallas Dickinson, Director of Production for BioWare Austin. The crew skill system in Star Wars The Old Republic is designed to give you the best of both worlds. We want you to be able to enjoy crafting without having to take time out from your adventures. As you travel the galaxy, you're going to pick up several companions, but only one at a time will join you on missions. The rest of them will be hanging out back on the ship, so why not put them to work? There are three different kinds of crew skills. Gathering skills, crafting skills, and mission skills. Gathering skills involve you or your companions collecting resources and information. Things like biometric analysis and scavenging. If you've trained your crew in scavenging, you can actually assign your companions to go out on their own to scavenge raw materials. This doesn't mean you can't do it yourself also. If you come across some salvageable material, you can pick it up yourself. Or you can have the companion traveling with you pick up the material while you keep fighting. You can then take the scavenged materials back to your ship and give them to another crew member to start crafting. You can choose from a few different crafting skills. If you've chosen to specialize in armor mech, your crew can create armor at the workstation on your ship. You actually don't even have to be on the ship yourself. You can send orders back and the crew can do the work all by themselves. Not only that, but as many as five companions can work at the workstation at the same time. Why don't you handle this? Last but not least, there are mission skills. These involve sending your crew members out to act on your behalf, doing things like trading or engaging in diplomacy. Sure thing, boss. You assign these missions simply by opening the interface and designating which crew member you want to send. Diplomacy missions take time, so when you send a crew member, they'll actually leave the ship and then return later with credits, valuable items, and sometimes they'll even earn you light or dark side points. Nothing else to report. Perhaps one of the coolest things about crew skills in the Old Republic is that even when you're offline, your companions will keep working, earning the rewards you'll get as soon as you log back in.